Many people think that when they believe for something and it doesn't happen, it's because they don't have enough faith. We see statements in the Bible like, I have not seen such great faith and automatically think that those people receive miracles because they had more faith. But the Bible says everyone has been given the same measure of faith. So it's not a matter of trying to drum up more faith. The difference is these people dealt with misbeliefs that were holding them back, which allowed the miraculous to flow unhindered. When we hold misbeliefs, we become double-minded, which prevents us from receiving from God. You see, to be double-minded is to entertain a lie or misbelief, and that becomes an opposing belief that comes against what you are believing God for. When you're believing for one thing, but your mind says, this can't actually happen, you have two opposing beliefs at work, and every belief you have has a corresponding consequence. For example, if you believe you're stupid, that will influence every area of your life. It'll stop you from hoping for an incredible spouse, going to university, or expecting a raise. You'll find yourself living a limited life, believing that lie. And when the truth is that you're just as smart, capable, and worthy as everyone else. Your life holds limitless potential, but your misbeliefs need to be dealt with in order to see change and growth. The good news is you do not need to fight the devil or plead with God to see these changes. To experience more of the miraculous, simply get into God's word and the truth truly will set you free. Devoted with Leon, daily encouragement for your spirit contemporary life.